Definitely, there's a lot more uh, behind it than um, just driving through water. Most people think bull bar, uh, suspension, winch, all that. But snorkel, if you're going to do a lot of gravel, it's a, it, it's a very important part of kitting, kitting your 4x4. Uh, it's even more important on a diesel motor than a petrol motor. But yes, it is available for the petrol as well. And um, as you mentioned, um, with all, all the rain that we're currently getting, and uh, Namibia is actually blessed with at this moment, um, a snorkel will definitely assist you. But driving through water is not the main idea of a snorkel. Um, if you're going to do a lot of gravel, and even on the tar road, um, if you think about all the heat generated by the motor, it's a heat coming, coming from, the, from the road itself, that pushing up the temperature of the air that is actually utilized by the motor, where with a snorkel, your, your air intake is above, so immediately your, your temperature of your air uh, utilized by your motor is lower and that will bring down the temperature of, or the actual running temperature of your vehicle as well. And most vehicles air intake sits in the wheel arch. Now that is where most of the dust is generated. And again, we're looking at the air intake of a snorkel. It's above, um, so you're getting cleaner air. It's less strain on your air filter and your motor is getting cleaner air. It's getting cooler air, which will result in again um, better performance from, from your motor. There's a lot more uh, behind it than um, just driving through water. Um, as mentioned, uh, you get cleaner air, you get cooler air. And apart from that, um, on the standard air intake, the vehicle's got to, got to suck the air in. It's got to work to actually get that air in. Where with a snorkel, if you look at the ram head, uh, the air is actually forced into, into your air box, which also assists your vehicle um, to, to run on lower engine temperatures.